hi you guys welcome back to my channel um so with this look today i'm going to be doing a blue lip so first i take my concealer and i prime my eyelids and as you can see i already did my eyebrows um i have a tutorial on how i do my eyebrows so you should go check that out um and by the way that's a scar on my lip so yeah don't think i have you know anything weird going on but yeah, now I'm priming my eyelids. I mean, I'm setting my eyelids with white powder. And then I took a fluffy brush with a eyeshadow that was close to my skin tone. And that's going to be my transition shade. Next, I took a purple. But it's not a deep purple. It's more of a light purple. Um, and I put it on my outer corner. I'm going to be gradually building up my outer V area to make it look more intense. Now I'm just taking that same fluffy brush and blending everything out, making sure everything is smooth. And by the way, this look today, I'm not going to apply any lashes. So, yeah. Hope you find some inspiration from it. Now I'm taking a deeper purple shade and I'm putting it on my outer V and I'm going to somewhat blend it out, not completely though, and I'm going to bring it in to my crease, but not bringing it all the way into where like my tear duct is. Now I'm going to cut my crease halfway with my concealer, so when I was doing this, at first, I was going to just cut it, you know, where my regular crease is. But I had looked up by accident and I got concealer above my crease. So I just took this cut crease a little bit higher than I normally would. But it still turned out good anyway. So yeah. I'm doing a half cut crease if I haven't said that already. Just making sure, you know, it's, it's very smooth. It's a very smooth surface. I'm bringing it up, the cut piece. As you can see, I do one eye at a time. Um, now I'm taking, you can't really see it, but it's a very, very light pink, shimmery eyeshadow. I took that and I placed it all over where I placed that concealer so it can make my eyelid you know look shiny in certain places now I'm just making sure that that surface is smooth then I took a it's a fluffy brush but it's not as fluffy as the other and I'm applying some more of that purple eyeshadow on the outer part since I want to blend it so it looks you know like they met but not like intense I'm just I just keep adding more layers of the purple but I add little by little I'm blending to make sure everything goes and looks smoothly. Smooth as it goes and looks smoothly. Wow. Taking more purple eyeshadow, but this time this shade is brighter than the shade that you see me put down. This purple is, you can see it better basically. And I'm putting that on my outer crease, but I'm not blending it all out because I still want it to show. I don't want it to look, you know, too blown out. Now I'm about to do some gel liner. Um, I have a black eyeliner, I'm sorry, black gel liner and my, from my Sephora box. And by the way, every color I've used is from 
my BH Cosmetics Modern Matte Palette or from my Sephora box. I wasn't gonna be sure how I wanted my wig to look this door door this, but yeah. All right. After all of this, I went and I applied my foundation and contour and set my face and applied my lip color. And here's a clip of the finished look. If you like my video, please subscribe, please share, and yeah, thanks for watching. Bye, you guys.